AG Squad, welcome back to another episode of Is It Worth It? So today's episode is this cool business part right here in my hand, if it's in C for the brand right there. And basically what this is, is a case for the brand new iPhone 12 and 12 Plus. So first thing first, let me actually open up the product to show you what it actually looks like before we test it out. So when you guys first open the product itself, this is basically what it looks like right here. So that's everything inside. So they give you guys the case itself right here. And then they also give you guys a little warranty card right here. So let's take a look at the product itself first. So when we take it out, this is basically what it looks like. A all clear design that's really high quality, if you guys feel it. These cases are also anti-yellowing, so you guys don't have to worry about that as well. But what's really cool about this product is the fact that it has this part right here. This is why it's called a moon climber, so it has the option to open it up. So you can pull it up to use it as a stand, which is pretty cool. And it also has this little film that you need to remove like by peeling it off like this, if you can see. And it can use the case itself. And also not only is the case anti-yellow, but it's also anti-scratch. The only thing bad about this case is the fact that it still has fingerprint on here. But if that's not an issue for you guys, then don't worry. But let me actually put it on the phone to show you what it actually looks like with the phone on. Alright, so I got my phone right here. Let me put it on. So all you guys need to do is just push in each corner, just like this. Snap it on. So once you guys put it on, this is basically what it looks like, if you can see. It only just has this little part sticking out. And if you guys look really carefully on the actual camera part right here, it actually sticks out a little bit, so you can actually have a little protection for the camera part right here. This is what the front part looks like. It doesn't really stick out too much. It's barely any that sticks out. But I don't think that should be a big issue because of the ceramic shield that's already built onto the new iPhone. As long as you guys have like an extra protection layer like the glass screen protector on here, then you should be fine. But everything else looks pretty amazing. If you can see the buttons right here. That's the one to turn off and on the product itself. If you guys turn over this side, you can see that you guys can press the slide button pretty easily. The volume up and volume down button pretty easy as well. And then they also do have the slot in the bottom for you guys to charge your device, if you can see. And the speaker part is open as well. So that's basically everything that's on the case itself. It definitely feels pretty nice. It has a very nice kind of like grip, like anti-skid material right here. So that way when you guys are holding it, it won't really move too much. So it gives you guys a good grip. And this case is also like drop protected or shock proof so that's definitely really cool but let me actually do a quick drop test to show you guys when it actually works or not so i'm just gonna do a quick one drop test like this where in one go it just drops it and you guys can hear the sound and everything so you guys can't really see from the top part but you guys can see it once it drops you guys can definitely hear it so three two one dunk just now from the drop test you guys can see that most likely it dropped around right here or right here in one of the corners so you can see that there's no scratches or anything on the case itself so that's basically everything that's on the product itself now let's actually do a quick test of the stand so i'm gonna use the little box right here as a sample for you guys but let's open up this first and just put it on like this right here all right so this is basically what it looks like like that if you guys can see and you guys can also use it the other way as well so like this if you guys can see so you guys have those two different ways or if you guys want to, you guys can go like this. So you guys have those three different ways to use it if you guys can see. And if you guys are wanting for the wireless charging when it actually works, it does work. But let me show you guys the quick test first and then we'll come back and talk more about the product in a second. Alright, so here we have the case right here. That is the Moon Climber one. Let's try it out and see when it actually works. Alright, so it does work. So even with the little part right here for the moon climber or the kickstand, it still works. Right, welcome back guys. So now that you guys saw the quick test of the wireless charging, you can see that it does work as well. So that's definitely really cool. But now that we do quick unboxing and testing of the product itself, now to answer the question of whether or not it's actually worth it or not. So for me, honestly, I would definitely have to say that this is worth it if you guys want one or need one of these, especially if you guys are trying to look for a phone case that's also drop protected and shock proof that has a built-in option where you can actually use it as a kickstand so you guys can hold the phone up if you guys want to watch videos or whatever on it. But then obviously for those guys who don't want or don't need one or have need one of these, then obviously don't buy one and save your money for something else that you do need. But other than that, that's been a for quick unboxing and testing of the product itself. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did, then make sure to subscribe, like, and comment down below. And if you guys like this video and you guys want to see more, then make sure to click on that notification in the bottom to be notified of new videos that will be coming up in the future. But as always, make sure to stay positive, be you, and I'll see you guys in the next episode of Is It Worth It? Peace. And then for today's G-Squad fan shout out day we have. <laughs>